and Jacob have to join forces uh, to save Bella. Um, how was it to join forces, and how hard was it for these guys to unite together? I don't think they completely unite. I mean, they're just for absolutely forced into it because they have no other choice. And there's no kind of, they're still not friends or anything afterwards. But I guess they kind of, they, they just get to a point where they, where they respect each other a little bit more. I guess for Edward especially, I mean, as Jacob is constantly saying, I'm gonna, I'm gonna try and keep stealing your girlfriend from you every single time I see her. I guess it is, it's, it's pretty difficult to accept someone like that being, uh, being in her life. Do you have the same uh, approach towards romance and love as uh, Edward? Edward's very extreme. <laughs> he kind of, he always thinks in these absolutes where uh, I can either be with her or I have to kill myself. <laughs> I mean, and I, I don't really think like that. Do you think the ironic and dark humor of the book is translated into the movie? It's just quite difficult because I mean, the general tone of the books is is pretty dark and quite intense. And I guess if you try and make too many funny bits in it, people won't really know like what they're watching. As the series goes on, they get a little bit lighter and a little bit funnier. I think. After three films, is it easier now to get into your character? To me, it's always felt like doing a brand new, like a completely different film every single time I've done another sequel for it. I mean, it's always a new director and there's always new challenges and things. So. In between the Twilight movies, you do other projects. Um, is that always hard to get back into that Twilight mood? I mean, it makes it easier if it's the same cast. If it was a different cast every time, I don't know if I would really remember what I was doing. I guess a lot of the you know, the, the way we interact with each other in reality definitely dictates a lot how, how we interact in the films. How do you see yourself uh, ten years from now? I hope I have a dog. <laughs> <laughs> What's your favorite moment out of all three Twilight movies? I still really like the moment in the first one where it's towards the end and Bella's in the hospital bed and uh, and uh, Edward, she's, she's saying, you can't, ever, you can't ever say you're going to leave me again. And, and Edward says, uh, where else am I going to go? And it's just, I always thought it was a really sweet little moment. I think it's probably my favorite bit. How would you define your character? Like a rebel, a hopeless romantic, stalker? <laughs> <laughs> like an extreme hopeless romantic. I mean, he's like utterly hopeless. <laughs> but uh, All right, well, thank you. Thank, thank you so you. much.